Hey guys, BB Chan here. Hope you guys are doing well. So we're gonna get into some Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 6 or Episode 43. Alright. Oh my gosh, what are they gonna do to him? Is Historia gonna help us? Is she going to follow her dad's? Mm-hmm. I hope so. Did she get brainwashed or is she lying? Is this the truth? Everything he's done is for the sake of humanity. Then why is he chained up? Why is that necessary? Could have been put in a jail cell and told him. Why is this necessary? Like, he can't even talk, he- I mean, I guess that's in case he turns into a titan. I guess that's why. My- my brain's a bit slow, but still, it's- You know, Eden's not going to turn if- And where are they? Haven't I- I- I'm thinking, like, his past- Like, he- he's related to his, the daughter, Frida, right? Cause like he had a dream about her, so Oh my god, what the hell is he gonna do? Does he know like a trigger on his neck or he might remember all of it? Oh my god, what secret does the rice Oh my god, their little cult and something went wrong and then that happened. Did this cause the How does it relate to his dad giving how did his dad get it? Was dad there is a doctor? And he he remember he transformed Where is this? I mean I know his dad is alive, right? I think. Did his dad die? No way. His dad didn't die. His dad died? I thought this happened like right after... Right after the... Colossal giant attacked. Titan attacked. Your father's sin? Oh my goodness! Crap. Okay, so from the little opening, the, the first part that we saw, so Frida does transform into a titan. Like, that was kind of like creepy seeing. I mean, it's not that creepy, but like, her, like, it was like half transforming and then she ate? Did she eat her siblings or attack them? And then, I don't know, this happened at the chapel, or the church, as they say it. I think they're underneath the church, right? But... Unless... The, the, the dad, his dad, the doctor, somehow got Frida's... I don't know, because Titans don't have blood. Or maybe she got the human Frida's blood, or... Or... Like, I can't think, like, whoa. Hmm. Some, she got, he, dad got something of Frida's. It could be, like, tears or, I don't know. I don't want to think about it. And inject it into Eden. And Eden turned into, a, like, Titan and possibly killed his dad. Because I thought his dad was alive. Cause I thought his dad was just in another town. Unless Eden mistaken that his dad was alive. Cause I don't know. I thought his dad was alive. I don't know. Oh my god. This is the episode.
Oh, with her big sis. Wait, is in the opening, is she with her sister and not her mom? Oh my gosh, she's reading a story about Titans and like it's, what's it doing? Oh, the girl in the story is called his, it's called Krista and she wants to be like Krista. Oh, got it, got it, got it. Oh, they have such a nice relationship. Uh-oh, those eyes. She's got like, secret missions to do. Oh my god, I'm thinking Itachi and Sasuke. Matane Sasuke. Oh, but there's some kind of connection. You saw the electricity thing? What'd she do? Oh, did she disappear? Oh, oh okay. Who? She he erased her! She erased her memories. Why? So she remembered also. He talks to her like is a stranger. Come on, tell us, dude. Did she really die? Is she somehow an Eden? <gasps> By his father, Grisha Jaeger? What? Why? Person with the He had the power of not to know who the man was. He wanted to steal the power. Man, those eyes! Holy crap! The, I hope he 
he's not making this up because that is a possibility. But now, because now she's gonna turn on Eden like your dad killed my family. And it's like, why does Eden have this power now? Who is coming? Oh, oh yeah, Kenny. Downstairs, or did he say outside? Are you? Hmm. All right. Wow, such loyalty. Oh. Hmm. Among with the powers of Titan, a special scream, the female Titan scream. Uh, so fast. Oh my god, is this punishment? Is this to the King Fritz? I mean, should, wouldn't he die just from his blood rushing into his brains? Oh my god, his face! Alter people's memories as it suits them. Oh my god, that Zachary person just... Yep, that's how a commander should be thinking. Oh my gosh, can you imagine that day when peace, no walls, no barriers? Yeah, we'll keep fighting until nobody is left. The wings of freedom. Oh man.
What is Historia thinking? Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. And we're not different race. Well, I mean, yeah, but we're still people. I confuse race with species, but... That surge of power. Wait, I thought Levi doesn't know his last name, or does he know now? Oh man. Used to be a warrior protecting the king. Oh, that's his gram. So that is a that he is an Ackerman. What did they do to make the king so mad at them? Yeah, he's not cute. <laughs> Because the real king is, they're afraid of us because we have power to, the king has saved us. Okay. Pass down the powers of titans, generation to generation. Wow, Aquaman news. His power to even alter, alter the humans' memories and make them f entirely forget the past. That's how we forget everything, except for a few noble bloodlines. One that there were two groups that turned their backs on. Two groups, huh? The Oriental clan and the Aquaman clan, and then. So Mikasa is like the embodiment of both strong clans. Kucho's been working on a power. So maybe that's why he took in Levi because he's like, I found another Aquaman.
Well, that was a abrupt transition. I was like, wait a minute. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the right question. It do you want to help us or continue with the king? Oh no, she's like reinstating her intentions. I mean, it looks like we just have a few of us, but do we have backup coming or? Cause he said he can't, don't go back for the troops. Mikasa's ready, don't even need to say it. Oh man, I wanted to find out more about the secrets. I guess we're gonna have to look. I mean, I don't know the... Shit, we got a few minutes. Oh my gosh, Kenny. Oh! Are you serious? I thought we had a few minutes! Because <laughs> I was checking the time and I was like, Oh, we got like two minutes. <sighs> Kenny versus Levi is coming up. It's coming soon. <laughs> oh my god. Now, I don't know if Historia is going to stay with us or if she's with her dad. Like I said, I don't know if his dad is making this shit up or if this is the truth. Because at the same time, I'm thinking maybe he's just saying this story to get his story on our side. But it seems like he's telling the truth. Like I'm, you know, because like I'm always thinking Eden's dad is like the good guy helping us. He knows some secrets, but did he really, his dad, the doctor, turn into some titan and steal Frida's I mean you know she transformed into her female titan form and then she fights him she gets destroyed because she doesn't know her full potential she can't use it and then do you think Eden's dad the doctor would just rip her out take him and then he could have just ran off with her but he killed every single one of the race family lord ran off himself because he knows he's got one extra child out there but that wasn't ah oh, something something nope there's nothing Oh man, oh man. Now Historia is just gonna be like, what the hell, Eden? Like, your dad killed off my family. And then remembering his past, his dad did all that. And then his dad also, you know, gave him a little syringe of injection. Like, I'm not really sure. I'm, I'm assuming it's Frida's blood. And that's why he can transform. He can use the scream, the power, the coordinates. And there's a possibility that somehow Historia will take Eden's power. Is that what Lord Rice is implying her to do? In the flashback, we see Eden transform. Like, where did he transform? It was like in a forest. Are they outside? Are they in a special secluded area in the forest? Because it looked like his dad died. It looked like his dad died because we're not sure. He, he picked up his dad glasses and then he's like oh so how did he return back to town like he forgot all of this but how would he have returned back like i don't know it just all confused and if that makes me think like what's at the basement what is down there with all the secrets and oh my god and then we go back to kenny he seems he's pretty faithful the king we get some backstory on ackerman you know kenny's talking with his grandpa's on his deathbed and he's like what happened with the ackerman what's this power of the titans like since the ackerman used to be like the warriors fighting for the king they're pretty close also another group that opposed the king was the orientals you know mikasa is best of both worlds and 
And Levi doesn't know all of this until finds out Kenny's last name and all that. So much has happened, like my head, like in a whirl, just like, what? And you know, the Zach Premier Zachary is just like torturing one of the lords and he's like, I've always wanted to do this. I'm hanging you upside down. After a few weeks, we're gonna like show you to the people and show horrible things you've done. You're gonna eat upside down. Like he's gonna die before that. I'm sh and then he has some kind of like tube attached to his mouth. I'm not really sure if it's attached to whatever body parts and he's like torturing it. Cause like you can see Zachary just like, ha <laughs> He's got this creepy, disgusting look on his face. And you know, I always thought he was just like an honorable man and like doing his duty. But you know, last episode he was saying how much he hated them, but like he just kept going with it and this perfect opportunity that Erwin gave him to pay them back. But it, it just looked like it went too far when he was like, you know, holding that like tube controller and he's just like, ah, like that with that face. Yeah, now that everyone of the people knows, and I think they got the lore to explain some of the powers so most of us knows about it. At the very end, you interior police that were with Kenny, and you know, they know the other interior police are gone. The government has been taken back, but they're like, are we doing this for a good cause? Because like in time, like Levi's group is going to take us down. Are we going to fall? Are they going to fall? Which sides? But she's like, no, we're going to stick with this side and like keep protecting what we believe in. Crap, I'm just wondering, my main concern right now is you can see all of us, Levi, we're about to open this like a uh, door and it's going to leave us lead us downstairs to where the attack is and we're gonna have Levi versus Kenny and all the other interior police in us but I'm ready to see Mikasa and Levi wreck shit of course there's like the other people but like you know our main fighters are the Ackermans, Kenny, Levi, and Mikasa going back my main question is will Historia still be on our side? I know I keep mentioning this but I just you know Historia is a nice girl normally she's so caring about Eden and stuff and seeing her backstory with Frida, she was just like, wow, who, that nice girl who was always there to look after me. She protected me and see if I was okay. This was when she was living with her mom. Like, what happened to my sister? And she's like, the dad explains about the, the doctor killing. Was there an ulterior motive? Did the race family, were they about to do something crazy? And that's why the doctor had to step in? Or what is the Dr. Jaeger's ulterior motive? These questions are just like racing through my head and I like I want to know it's like oh go read the manga but I want to like watch it in the anime form so like oh oh my gosh next week it's all gonna get down man these episodes are going really good so like we got a lot of flashback and more secrets revealed I'm loving it please tell me your thoughts how you feel about this episode I'll be sure to read them and see you guys for next reaction peace out